All right then. Today, Mikey and I are making a video where I'll be showing him the house I built. With that in mind, I'd like to do one last check over my house before Mikey arrives. I should make sure everything's good if we're going to record a video here. I worked really hard on this house, so I can't wait to do an introduction video. All right, I'll start by doing a final check of the entrance. Here it is. I made the entrance pretty big. Huh? Hang on. Uh, did I leave these pieces of carpet lying around? Huh, I don't remember putting carpet down here. Hmm. They really don't match the atmosphere of the entrance. I better clean these up. Whoa! That was close! Whoa, what's that? Why is there a magma block in a place like this? If I'd accidentally stepped on this piece of carpet, I would have taken damage. I didn't put that there. Huh? What about this one? Ugh. There's more magma under the other pieces of carpet. What? What's going on? Wait a minute. Ugh. Did Mikey do this? He set traps in my house when I wasn't around. Is Mikey trying to play a prank on me? Huh. Ugh. Seriously? Let's check the footage from the security camera I placed up there. I knew it! Mikey's trying to pull a prank on me! Okay, in that case, I'll pull a reverse prank by redoing all of Mikey's traps before he gets here! Okay, first up, let's destroy these magma blocks. They're dangerous. I'll break them all. Now, what kind of reverse prank do I want to put here? Hmm... Mikey hid magma blocks under the carpet, so I'll build off that. Let's set this up so that if he removes the carpet, instead of finding a magma block, spikes will pop out from everywhere! Haha! <laughs> I'll start by putting these back. Next, I'll cover the floor in these spike traps. Like that. The spikes pop up if you step on them. I'll cover the entire floor with these, just like this. Alright, last one. Now, spikes pop up when you walk over them. Okay! However, the way it is now, the spike trap will be obvious. So I'll camouflage it with some brown carpet. Hmm. I'll place lots and lots of carpet on the spike floor. This will camouflage all of the spike traps, like this. Alright! I finished covering everything up with carpet. Now when these pieces of carpet are broken, I want all of the spikes to shoot up at once. I'll dig under here to set it up. Just like this. Oh, here it is. Okay. I'll place an observer and then some red carpet on top. If Mikey removes this piece of carpet, all of the spikes will shoot out at once. All right, I'm finished. I set it up so that when Mikey realizes the red carpet isn't causing me any damage, he'll remove it to check causing all of the spikes to shoot out at once. Okay, all done. I can pull a reverse prank on Mikey now. I wonder if he'll fall for it. Huh? Hey, what's that noise? Uh-oh, that doesn't sound good. Huh? What? It's coming from over here. That's my bedroom. I hear a strange noise coming from inside. What's going on here? This is the nice bedroom that I put together for myself. Huh? Over here. I can hear it coming from over here. That really annoying noise is coming from under my bed. Huh? Oh, come on. One of the blocks under my bed has changed. What is it? I'll check it out. Hmm? Huh? Oh, the noise is coming from this jukebox. Did Mikey put this trap here to keep me from sleeping? Now I need to redo this trap too. I know. I'll set up a bunch of bells to go off as soon as Mikey enters my bedroom. First, I'll put my bed back. I took the disc out of the jukebox so it won't make any more noise. Mikey will probably rush over to check on it, so I'll leave the room when he goes to look. 
I'll come out here, like this. Huh. Then I should place a lever right around here. I'll put it here. When I pull it, I'll set it up so that a lot of bells will start ringing while Mikey's still alone in my room. Okay! Next, I'll make a redstone circuit under here. I'll place the redstone like this. When I pull this lever, it'll power up the redstone. Now I'll extend this out. I want to hook it up inside the room like this. Next, I'll make a space. I think I'll temporarily remove the carpet like this. Then, right around here, I'll make a space to place my bells. All right, almost done. I've made my space here for the bells to go. Now I need to connect the line of redstone dust from earlier. Is it over here? Oh, there it is. <clears throat> In that case, I'll build a step and connect it. The redstone signal won't reach, so I'll place repeaters to extend it. Nice! I'll use the redstone signal here and hook it to a clock circuit to continually send new signals. Next, I'll place a lot of bells over here. Okay, now I can hide all of that under the floor, just like this. Nice! Now once I fill this in, I'm done. Alright, now Mikey won't hear anything, even if he enters the bedroom. While he's here trying to figure out what's going on, I can flip the lever out here and make all of the bells ring in the bedroom. It's gonna be so loud. Alright, that's finished. Huh, however, if Mikey also trapped the bedroom, it's possible he may have put a trap in my kitchen as well. Huh, let's go check out the kitchen. Hmm, I put a lot of time and effort into designing my kitchen. Hmm, it's meant to feel luxurious and clean. Something tells me Mikey has set up some kind of trap in here too. Nothing seems out of place so far. Huh, I should check these. Let's take a look at the refrigerator. Hmm? Hang on! All the meat I put in here has been replaced with rotten flesh! Hang on, what about the chess? Ugh, no way! Ugh, they're all full of rotten flesh! Ugh, you know, this must be Mikey's doing. He wants me to eat rotten flesh! Let's check the tape. Well, there's no way I want to eat rotten flesh. So let's set up a reverse prank for Mikey. I'll start by placing a lever here. When I pull this lever, hmm, maybe I should make it cover the whole room? I'll set up a reverse prank so this section of the floor releases stacks of cake. <laughs> I'll build a mechanism to release lots of cake from beneath the floor. I'll set this lever to send a redstone signal. I'll make a space under here. This is probably big enough. Now, in order to have a redstone signal reach it, I'll make a little tunnel. I want to make it so that cakes are released from beneath the floor here. So, I'll place dispensers full of cakes. Now, when the signal reaches this observer, Cakes will start popping out like that! Next, I'll set it up to send the redstone signal under everything. Something like this. Now the signal will reach each of these redstone repeaters. Yes! Now to place loads of dispensers full of cakes. Alright. Now I'll place redstone dust all across the floor. Just like this. Okay, I've covered the floor. 
So now we'll place observers, like so. Hmm. All right, I've placed the observers. Now for this layer, I'll place the cake-filled dispensers. Almost done. Hmm. Next, I'll hide all of this under the floor, just like this. Almost done? All right. Now, so Mikey doesn't suspect anything, I'll put the carpet back too, just like this, so he can't tell. Is this about right? Okay, I'm done hiding my work. Now I'll close this up. All right, done. If Mikey tries to get me to eat this rotten flesh, then I'll pull this lever, causing piles of cakes to appear for me to eat. He'll be so surprised. Hmm, so it turns out Mikey placed traps in all of my rooms, but I think it's fine now. Oh, that's right. I also built a secret room over here. You can actually pass through the painting. I've hidden my vault in here, but wait, Mikey wouldn't. Surely he couldn't have placed traps inside my super secret room. Still, I should check it out just to be safe. I think I'll go in. Ready? Here's my vault. I've collected lots of rare ores, which I've hidden inside this room. Hmm, but I've never mentioned my vault to Mikey, so... Hang on. I know I filled all these chests with ores, but I don't remember putting that chest there. Huh, that's sus. Hang on. Aha! The floor under the chest is different. What's that? Hmm? What is it? Oh, is that a dispenser? Let's check what's inside. Oh, there's a zombie spawn egg in here. Hmm, upon a closer look, this is a trap chest. Mikey set up this chest so a zombie will spawn when I open it. Huh. I didn't expect him to put a trap in my secret room. Okay, I'm redoing this trap. Since Mikey made a trap that releases one zombie, I'll make a trap that releases a swarm of zombies. I have just the space on the sides back here. Hmm, I'll set up my trap to release the swarm of zombies. Now, Mikey was using a dispenser, so I'll use a dispenser for mine too. I'll fill it up with stacks of zombie spawn eggs. Then, I'll add more of them, like so. And do the same on the opposite side. Let's make it so a huge swarm of zombies pops out. Although, they look very obvious as they are right now, so... I'm gonna camouflage them somehow. I could dig a hole like this. Then right here, I'll use the same material as the floor, then set up some sticky pistons beneath it, like this. Then behind those, right here, I'll set up redstone repeaters and connect them with redstone dust. Here, when the redstone signal connects here, the dispensers will be hidden. Now, when the trap chest is opened, let's make that trigger the pistons. It's all hooked up. Now, when this trap chest is opened, the redstone circuit will activate from down below. Then, the zombie spawn eggs will be released from the dispensers, causing zombies to appear. And done. When the trap chest is opened, a redstone signal is released. Ha <laughs> ha, just like that. Uh, shoot, it's releasing them. Mikey's gonna be so surprised. I'll do the same on the other side. Now to connect this and place the redstone block. Now to hide it. And I'm done. Once this trap chest is opened, Mikey's really gonna have his hands full. Still, right now, I have nowhere to escape to. The swarm will have me cornered, so let's make a secret staircase. 
I'll build a secret staircase somewhere under here to escape to. I'll build an escape mechanism too. Let's build the staircase right away. Build it around here. I'll open up a space for a hidden staircase. All right, done. Next, I'll make the mechanism for the secret staircase. In order to make the staircase emerge, I'll place sticky pistons here and attach slime blocks and honey blocks to them. Let's try it out. Whoa! Now the mechanism to deploy and retract the staircase is complete. Push this button and... Then if I push the other button... I can control the mechanism with both of these buttons. Now if I place stone stairs here to make the staircase... My retractable secret staircase is complete! Let's close all of this up now. I'll hit this... And now I can close all of this off. I'll use the same floor material to hide it. Next, I guess I'll set up the armor stand. I'll put it back here and... Okay, finished. If I push this button, the secret staircase opens up, just like this. And I can close it with this button. I can also control it from this side. With that, my secret staircase is finished. Still, a swarm of zombies will probably reach down here, so I'll need to extend this staircase deeper. Add some more steps, like this. This is a hassle. I'm gonna blow up this area with TNT. I think that will give me an open space much faster. I'll place lots of TNT right around here. I wanna dig all the way down to the bedrock layer. I'll light this TNT and set off a chain reaction to create a big space. Whoa! Whoa! Oh wow! The chain reaction is working! Whoa! Awesome! Looks like it's digging all the way down. Ho-ho! <laughs> it blasted it all clear for me. Cool. All right. Now I guess I'll tidy this up. Okay, and with that, I finished cleaning up this area. Here are the stairs, which I'll come down to from the hallway. Next up, I'll build my escape device. I want to escape back up to the surface, but let's see here. I'll make my TNT cannon right here. I'll use the explosion from the TNT to launch myself into the air. For this next and final part, I'll leave a button here to make the TNT launch me into the air. It's set up so that pushing it will launch me and allow me to escape. With that said, I've swapped out Mikey's trap in my hidden room with my own reverse prank trap. But just to be sure, I think I'll put a diamond sword in the trap chest. Like this. I'll leave the diamond sword inside so I can use it to fight off the zombies that'll spawn. Okay! Now to wait for Mikey to come over so I can trick him with my reverse pranks. I wonder if Mikey will even realize that his traps have undergone a little renovation. All right then, today I'll be showing off my new house. Huh? What's up, Mikey? You look fidgety. What are you so fidgety for? Huh? No, I'm not fidgeting at all. <laughs> Come on, JJ! Never mind that! And show me the house already! Sure, I'll show you the house I built. Okay, let's go! You seem really excited, Mikey. Yep! Huh? Let's go! Alright then, this is the house I built. As you can see... Yeah, yeah, it's nice. I made sure the exterior is also nice. But I'll be showing you the interior. First up, this is the entrance to my house. This is how it looks. Whoa! It's very roomy. Wow, awesome! Hmm. What a big room! Huh. It's very big. Whoa! Huh? 
Uh, what's wrong? Huh? Nothing. What's up, Mikey? Huh? It's nothing. Nothing at all. Yeah, don't just stand there. Move along. <laughs> hmm, sure. The thing is about this huge entrance room. Huh? Wait. Huh? What's wrong, Mikey? Huh? It's nothing. Nothing at all. Huh. Actually, Mikey, uh, huh? Did I actually use red carpet here? Huh. Here's another piece of red carpet. Huh? And another one. Huh? But why? Why, why, what? Huh? How is this possible? Why aren't you taking damage? Huh? Huh? What'd you say? Huh? Something wrong? What? What are you checking for, Mikey? The magma blocks are all gone! Huh? What's going on? Huh? <gasps> Ouch! What is this? <laughs> I don't like that! Ah! Mikey, are you okay? Oh, somehow some spikes came out of the floor to kill me! Oh! Oh, you know, maybe my anti-zombie security system accidentally got set off. Uh, oh, oh well. You must have a lot more rooms. Show them to me already. Huh, maybe your bedroom would be good next. <laughs> oh, sure. Huh. I still have more rooms, so I'll show you my bedroom next. All right, let's go. <laughs> you look excited about something, Mikey. Huh? Uh, uh, of course I don't. You don't? Let's go already. Next up. This is my bedroom. Huh? 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 What's wrong, Mikey? Uh... What's wrong? Huh? How? I can't hear anything. Why not? Huh? Uh, Mikey, you're acting kind of weird. Uh, no. It's nothing. Huh. I guess we should go inside. Let's go in. And now, open. Huh. All right. Okay. Huh? This is my huge bedroom. My own private space. Huh? Hmm? I can't hear anything. Why are you acting so strange? Huh? Uh, huh. It's nothing. Hmm. Huh? Why is it making that noise? Oh? Huh? That's strange. All right, now's my chance. I'll close these, and now I'll set off the reverse prank. Okay, lever, on. <laughs> What's that noise? Hang on, where's the off button? Ah, it's so noisy. <laughs> What's going on? Ah, it's too loud. All right, what? lever off. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> Are you okay? in your room and suddenly lots of bells started going off. Ah, what was that? Oh, really? Huh, well, let me check. Hmm? Bells? The sound of bells? I don't see any bells anywhere. Huh. How weird. That's not what I set up. I mean, it really surprised me. Pull yourself together, Mikey. Now, what room shall I show off next? Oh, JJ? Huh? How about we do the kitchen next? <laughs> Getting surprised made me hungry. Sure, to the kitchen. All right, let's go. Okay. Hmm, you seem really excited again, Mikey. Oh, nah, I'm not excited. Let's go. Oh, really? <laughs> Moving on, I'll show you my kitchen. Here it is. Whoa. It has a large open space. Wow, what a big room. Very organized, too. Huh. Oh, it's awesome. It is, isn't it? Now, near the end of this room is the kitchen. Oh. Huh. I think I've designed it really nicely. Impressive. Hmm. Oh, you must be hungry, too, right, JJ? I'll get you something. <laughs> oh? Just a moment. Um. Thank you, Mikey. There are chests and a refrigerator. There should be some meat in there. Huh? What's wrong, Mikey? Huh? 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 Huh?
You're not taking good care of it, JJ. <laughs> oh, so all the meat I left in the chest has gone bad? Aww. I guess you have to eat these. No problem. For times like these, I have an emergency food supply. I'll just pull this lever. Huh? <gasps> What's going on? <laughs> what? The floor is overflowing with cakes! Huh? That's right. <gasps> this is my emergency food. Just grab some, like this, and put them down to eat as much cake as you want. <gasps> what is all this? <laughs> Just like this. Unbelievable! I'm gonna eat lots of cake. Incredible! But how? All right, I'm getting hungry, so I guess I'll eat. Oh, this tastes great! <gasps> Lucky JJ, I want to eat cake too! Go for it, Mikey. Let's eat cake together. Oh, really? Chow time! Oh, uh -huh. oh, yum, 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 yum. oh! Oh, yeah! I'm sure glad I had these on hand. Oh, yum, 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 yum. <laughs> I'm so full already. <laughs> all right. <sighs> I think that's all about there is to see. Uh, JJ, there must be something else. Huh? I don't think you've shown me everything. Hmm? That's right. I almost forgot. There is one last room I can show you. It's over this way. Oh. Let's go! It's through here. Yep. Oh, where is it? There's actually a secret room behind this painting. Is that so? No way! What kind of room is it? Well… well let's go inside! <laughs> you're very excited, Mikey. Oh, what was that? Nah, no such thing. Let's go! Alright, this painting is actually a secret entrance, so we can go right through. Huh. Let's go! <laughs> okay. Oh, awesome! All right, this is my secret room. This is my vault. Wow! It's where I keep all of my treasures. Whoa! Cool! Isn't it? Oh, can you show me what kind of treasures you have? Sure! JJ, I really want to know what's inside that chest! Oh, that? Uh-huh! You mean this chest? <laughs> uh-huh, yes! That chest! Hmm… Open it and show me! You can open it, Mikey! Huh? Huh? I could never! I couldn't possibly touch one of your treasures, JJ! I want you to be the one to open it! <laughs> hmm, did I put that chest there? Oh well, <laughs> I guess I'll open it, Mikey! Hmm. Then I'll just take a step back! Hmm. Uh, why would you need to take a step back? No, never mind! Hurry up, JJ! Open it! You're smirking! Whatever! Never mind that, JJ! Okay, I'm opening the chest! Three, two, one, open! Yes! Huh? huh? Oh, what? Zombies? Hang on! That's not the trap I set! Ouch! Actually, I redid all of the traps you set, Mikey! Ouch! Seriously? Are you kidding me? Okay, I'm gonna open the staircase and run away! They killed me! No! Yeah, the zombies are after me! Shoot! They're coming down the stairs! Ugh, gotta get away fast! Uh, hurry, hurry! Alright, I'm getting away while I still can. Down the stairs and. Okay, I'm here. This is where I'll equip myself. Okay, next up, I better eat my golden apple! Perfect! And now I'll escape! Whoa! I'm really flying! Alright! Mikey, my reverse pranks worked! What is even happening? If you enjoyed today's adventure, make sure to like and subscribe! Plus, you can check us out on Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok whenever you want with the links in the corner! Thanks for watching! See you next time!